Hello and welcome to my next video. I know I haven't made a video in a long time, but really it's been so hot lately and it gets so hot in the morning here. If I wait a couple hours it gets so hot and my makeup is literally falling off, like just melting off, so it's gross. I really hope you enjoy this video and I'm, I'm sorry I haven't been here for a while. Please forgive me. Anyways, let's get started. So this is one of my DIY hair oils that I use. I reuse a bottle that I got from an India store, Indian store called Vaktika. I'm going to show you how I make my own hair oils to keep my hair long and healthy and keep the ends from not getting split. And so far it's been working. It's been about a year since I started growing my hair. Okay, so this is the bottle that I'm going to use to put my hair oils in. It's an old container that's empty. When I make my own hair oils, I usually stick with the two that I think help my hair the most, which is extra virgin olive oil mixed with pure grapeseed oil. Now these really work really great for my hair. They have a lot of fatty acids in it that help to coat your hair and soften and condition it so that your hair can stay healthy. As you can see, there's rosemary in here. Rosemary is very beneficial to your hair, especially to your scalp. I've heard that it actually can stimulate hair growth because it brings blood to the scalp, which helps it to grow a little faster. I'm just going to take this off, and I'm going to do about half and half equal parts of pure grapeseed oil and extra virgin olive. See it going in there? Now it's basically full, if you can see. There's a little bit of room for the rosemary that I'm going to put in there. So what I do is, basically I just pour as much as I think I need, pour it into here, and then fold it like this. Smell it, it smells good. Then I just very carefully pour it into there, trying not to spill. Just shake it really well and there's a DIY hair oil. I don't want to actually put rosemary in my hair so I just want the oil that's infused with it. I'll usually take a cup like this and something like this, a little strainer, start to pour it into the cup without any of the rosemary getting in there. See how it's strained at all? There's almost no rosemary in there. So now I'm going to actually put it in my hair. I don't want to get anything on here so I'm just going to take this off. I usually part it into two sections, like, like the way I braid my hair, and I just start from the bottom like that and work my way up. It's good to make sure you really get it into your scalp too, because the rosemary will help to stimulate the blood flow to your hair follicles so that your hair will grow faster. Olive oil is very high in vitamin E, which is known to be very good for your hair. Is there anything that you do with your hair to help deep condition it? Do you put any herbs in it like rosemary or anything? Let me know in the comments. I really hope you enjoyed my video. Thank you for watching. By the way, my next video will be also will be another DIY. Comment anything, any ideas you have for more DIYs or any um, hair care routines that you have or what you do to deep condition your hair like this. I want to know so please comment below. Bye.